Hello everyone, my name is Emily, and this is a Clay Pit Ponds special report, coming to you live from Clay Pit Ponds State Park Preserve. Today, we're covering the topic of littering, a concerning topic to be sure. Let's turn it over to our reporter in the field. Emily? Thanks, Emily. I'm here on the Orange Trail, and as I walk, I will occasionally see a piece of trash. This could have fallen out of someone's pocket, been brought here by rain runoff, or been purposely thrown here. Either way, it came from a human and is considered litter. Besides the fact that no one wants to look at garbage as they walk along these beautiful trails, litter is bad for the environment. Why? Let's ask an environmental educator here at the park. Emily? Thanks, Emily. Well, for one reason, most litter is made out of plastic, which is not biodegradable and can leak toxins into the environment. A shiny, small piece of plastic might be mistaken as food by animals such as birds and squirrels. And birds might try to feed their babies this piece of plastic, which can lead to digestive problems, making animals sick, and even die. When you throw out a piece of trash out of your car window, it doesn't just go away. It can be washed into storm drains, which lead to rivers and the ocean, contaminating water supply and adding to the enormous amount of plastic pollution already in our oceans. So dispose of your trash properly. It's as simple as that. And recycle when you can. If you're walking along the trails and you see a piece of trash, see if it's safe enough to pick up and throw away. And look out for beach and park cleanups near you. We all need to do our part to keep the planet safe and clean. Thanks, Emily. I'll make sure to put my trash in a proper trash receptacle. That's all for this special report. Back to you, Emily. Thanks, Emily. This has been a Clay Pit Ponds special report. Tune in next week as we discuss the fourth principle of leave no trace. Leave what you find. Thanks for watching everyone. Stay safe out there.